but educating yourself um, to improve your skills. Um, put a tip jar to the side. Take all your tip money, you put it in that jar, and that is just for seminars, maybe a new pair of shears, maybe a new piece of equipment, um, something like that. But that money is just for your self-improvement, okay? Um, if you have a bather brusher and you can send them to a seminar to go through a certification um, of bather brushers. Now, I will say that I, if I was going to be sending people to a seminar, when they got back, in order for them to be reimbursed for it, they would have to write me a paper on what they learned. I want to know what seminars they went to. I want to know what they learned. I want to, because if they can't tell you that, then they probably skipped out on you and didn't go. So people need to be held accountable. And you as well. A lot of mornings, it'd be easy. They have parties of a night. It's easy to go, oh, wow, well, man, I went to that party. We had a great time, but I'm going to sleep in this morning. No, you can sleep in on Saturday and Sunday or on Sunday or your day off. But don't sleep in at a seminar. Get up. Make it to everything you can possibly get to. You've spent the money. Make sure you get the most bang for your buck.